and welcome to the One Stop Co-op Shop. Today my wife and I are going to do a two-player playthrough of Virus. I just want to do a shout out for my wife quick. She read all these rules for me because I was having such a hard time getting through this. So she is going to be the rule queen, not me. <laughs> so if we're doing anything wrong, you know who to blame. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, okay, if you'd like to see how to set up the game, feel free to watch the video before this. Otherwise, we're going to jump right in. So... What we do at the beginning is we normally have an event phase. However, the first round you don't have an event. So then we move from there to the real time phase. Just so you know, in this game you're not supposed to do any planning together outside of the real time phase. Monica and I are going to try really hard to do that, but it's first of all it's hard to do that and second of all it's just hard to to do that because we just immediately start talking to each other. <laughs> so if we do start planning a little bit, sorry, we'll try really hard not to. Um, so we're gonna jump right into the real time phase. You ready, honey? Ready? Now, you know what you're doing. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. I have no idea what she's doing, so we're gonna just kinda do it. Oh, and I'm gonna be black. Monica's gonna be peach. Slash uh, orange, my cubes are orange. Her, her cubes are orange. Uh, we're not using the minis because they look so similar to the enemies. Oh yeah, I'm so glad I said that because we need to spawn enemies. Oh, yeah. So, what you need to do at the beginning of the game is you spawn X plus one, where X is the amount of players. So we've got two players plus one, three enemies. There are four different types. We're gonna start with these, uh, what do we call them, blutters. Is that okay with you? Mm -hmm. So, and where do we wanna put them? Here, okay. So these blutters, they do one additional damage if they hit you, so they hit you for two damage. However, they only have one HP. And how you defeat them is when you um, when you roll your cubes, because that's how you're going to fight, which is so cool and such a unique way of fighting. You have to get three points of damage to be able to defeat any of the enemies. That does one hit of damage if you get three points on your board. Uh, if there's leaders or zombies, they need two points, so they're gonna, you're going to need to have six successes on your board. And how that works... We're not even going to talk about that till that happens. I don't think either of us are planning on fighting, right? No, but we're not no. going to talk about it easy in real time. Do you want to no. show them a combat? Well, we'll show them a combat when we think we're going to do it in that round. Okay. We'll explain it. Okay. Because this round, we're not going to we're not going to do a okay. fight. So, all right. Are you ready? You ready to hit the, the play button? Ready when you are. I'm ready. You guys, it's already a round two. We started, and I started grabbing from my supply. <laughs> so it's kind of cheating. We already know what we're going to be doing this first round, but that's okay. We're just going to get going. Let's start it. Alright, set. Go. Go. Okay. Oops. There. And then do this. Move here. Explore. This one. Then go here. Explore. And drop three to search. And then get my butt out of town. And I'm going to move to this one. Right here. And that's, oh, we got 14, so, 14 seconds. seconds. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's talk quick. So you're just trying to get Sorry, over there? Yeah, I'm, okay. I'm just did lots of blue and I'm okay. essentially done with my and blue now. I've got green. I might just stop I'm just, right there. I think I'm going to stop there. Cause I, I already spawned way too many enemies. Yeah, you're so. going to spawn a leader. One, two, three, four. I'm going to spawn a leader. So we're yeah. already going to have two leaders. Okay, it's done. So we have just finished the, finished the real time. Sorry, my uh, board. Actually, is it okay if we just keep it like that? That should work. Yeah, it's fine okay. with me. So from the real time phase, we then move to the slow phase. Slow phase, the first thing you have is creature movement. Now, how creatures movement works. First, they see if they can see you. They can see you within an area of four. Everything is within an area of four. So can they see anybody with a straight line of sight of area four? No, because this room has not been explored. Think of it as it's not even there yet. So they can't see me. They can't see Monica. Then they smell. Mm -hmm. So to smell, they're smelling between, if you're four rooms away, one, two, three, four. So I'm four rooms away. So they can smell me. So they will move here. But if they couldn't smell me, let's say I was here, they could still hear us. And that's how these action cubes work. Such a cool idea. We're basically dropping sound as we're moving through these rooms. And so they would then hear us and would follow. Now, if they heard us, we would get to decide which way they would move because they would hear within two and hear within two for me over here. But they actually smell me. One, two, three, four. They don't smell Monica because she was blowing out water over <laughs> here. Jeez. 
So they're going to come here looking to go this way. Um, oh, that's great. I told, I, I dropped one in here and then it, oh, no, whatever. I, I, I searched, but I didn't do this thing. Oh, well, whatever. Okay. So after that, then we have to spawn creatures and we have to spawn a creature in every room we have laid a cube in. For, for every room that you've laid a cube in. So I have laid one, two, three, four cubes. So because I've laid four cubes, I have to spawn four enemies. But anytime you spawn four or more enemies, one of them has to be a leader. So I'm gonna grab the sniffer. And what he does is he can sniff anywhere. And so the first thing I'll have to do is place him. Which leader are you gonna grab? Because you would definitely have more than four. Uh, I'll do the trample guy. The trample guy. Which is this guy. Okay. He can push into rooms that have a max limit, right? Yeah. Did you not search? You didn't search, No, did I you? didn't need to because I oh. played so many cubes. Oh, that's a good point. See, I love how you know that. <laughs> okay. But then, I, then we have to determine how many more creatures to spawn. So I had to do four minus one, so I'll do three. So I'm going to grab um, two of these blutters and one of these trickers. Trickers... All they do that's different is if you're trying to dodge them during a fight, you have to get one additional success. Normally, you only need one, one dodge. So against them, you'll need two dodge, two successes. So you can place them. You have to place them in empty rooms first. So I'll place both of these in empty rooms. Now, all the rooms that I've explored in are full because one of them I'm in. So then I can place the second one anywhere on the board uh, in my area right in your active area in my active Some, somewhere area somewhere that you laid cubes now the alternative is if you don't want to place this guy you can choose to do one enemy movement instead of placing him i'm definitely going to place him i think that's not bad. yeah I usually one here's the other thing since we're playing on easy these monsters all have one movement except for leaders leaders move two and dogs which we haven't gotten dogs yet because we don't want dogs <laughs> so that's me now monica you spawn now normally all the other rounds we're going to spawn simultaneously we're just showing you how to do this individually this round but normally we'll spawn all at the same time so i'll be picking my monsters and she'll be picking hers and that's the other interesting thing about this game is that you get to choose which enemies to spawn so i put cubes in one two three four five six rooms Jeez. so i have to spawn six i've already done one which means i have to do five more and so she's the, bringing in zombies the new one is the zombies they need an extra damage to kill so most of the time you need three successes or one damage point to kill a monster these ones need two damage points or six successes which is a lot that is a lot so first i have to place them in all empty rooms and then I have to place this lovely guy. Well, I might as well. Well, if I place him, well, he's going to get two anyways. I'll place him here. So now, how this works, whenever there's uh, enemies with a leader, even though this zombie only moves one, this leader is going to push him and make him move two, which is terrible. So that's how we spawn the, uh, the enemies. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to determine our resources. Well, first, we look to see if we get wounds. Neither of us should get wounds because we didn't fight anybody, anything like that. Then we gain resources. This is also convoluted. <laughs> Let's do me first. So what I do is I look to see, first, did I search? I did search. I dropped three action cues to say I searched this room. So then I look to see how many rooms match that color that are connected. I have one, two, three rooms. I should have connected it here, but I didn't. Three rooms. Then I multiply that by the amount that I searched in, which was two. Two plus the two for searching, which is four. So three times four is 12. Plus I get one for searching here, or exploring here. So that's 13. Mm -hmm. So I get 13 resources. What do you get? Um, I just did a big chunk of blue. So the size of the room is one, two, three, four, five, six. And I didn't search, but I did one, two, three, four, five explore actions. So I get five times six is 30 resources. And so then the other caveat is you max out at 30. So I, I hit it right. I got 30 resources. Jeez, you did that perfect. Oh, yeah, well, I got 13 resources. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, you so then... 
Yep, yep, yep. So then what I can just choose to do if I want, and I think I'm going to do it, is take two rooms that match the, they have to be the exact same type of room, and they have to be the same color, and I can discard them to gain three more resources. So they have to be the same type, meaning they have to be the same layout. They don't both have to have plus ones, these just happen to. Um, so they have to be the same layout and the same color. So I discard these two, and I add three more resources. So I have 16 resources. And that's indicated on your on your player board down at the bottom. It says a pair is worth three resources. If you were to happen to have three of a kind, you would get seven, and four of a kind would be 11 extra resources. You can also take a minor advantage, right? That's what it's called? Yeah. And a minor advantage, I'd flip this over. Now I have one of my um, tiles I could no longer use. It's locked uh, because it's a trap, and I can't lay a trap on my own. But then I gain six additional resources, but I'm not going to do that. So now we get to buy. I'm going to buy two hearts. Each heart is worth eight. So I, because I had 16 resources, I'm paying all 16 to get two more hearts. What that means is now each round I'll recover five action cubes instead of just three. I have 30 resources, so I'm going to buy two hearts. That's 16. One syringe, that makes 25 and a shield, which makes 30. Perfect. After we grab all of that, we take all of our cubes back from the board and put them back in our supply, our, not our supply, but our um, reserve over here. And then we gain all of our action points or action uh, cubes equal to our stamina. So we're both at five. So we'll both get five, three, four, five. And I had two left over, so that's nice. Three left. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Then we have ended our first round. Woohoo! Oh gosh, this got hit. Okay, there we go. Oh no, we haven't ended the first round. We got to drop our knowledge. We also have to refresh our knowledge. So how many do you need? Um, I need five. Oh, you got five, and you've got one lab. Nice. Sweet. And I need three, four. Three, four, five. I need five too. Okay. I didn't get any labs. It was a bummer. So now we're going to strategize in our heads. We're not going to talk together, but we're going to think about what we want to do. And then during the real time phase, this time we should probably talk a little more. <laughs> we kind of knew what we were going to do at the beginning because of how the tiles were laid out. But now we should try and work together as much as we can. To, uh, but we can't do that until we get to the real-time phase. So first, we're going to think on our own. One more note that we didn't mention before. You have to lie tiles so that all the doors line up, meaning I can't, I can't go like this and place this door here because there's no door to go into that room. Yeah, so it's not like how some of the real-time games where if you, you can block off doors with walls. You can't do that. Yeah, if there's a door here, when you put a tile there, it has to have a door. All right, let's think. Okay, so both Monica and I have strategized in our brains, and so we'll start the next round by drawing an event card. What we have here is small spaces. Rooms with four openings may not be placed, and we have a trap. So what that means, with the trap, we each draw the a top card from this pile over here. So here's yours, honey, and here's mine. We flip them over, and we have to place them somewhere that it's legal on, our, uh, on the board. Sorry, this is kind of encroaching on your Yeah, space. that's okay. I'll just move mine over. I think they can still see it. Yeah, they've got, they actually can see. I'll move these over more. I'm hoping not to go that direction, so you should yep. be okay. Okay, but that way you have some room. That's why I put the trap over there. And I can even try and do that. Yeah, and actually mine worked out pretty well. I put the trap here, and nice. so if we can get, because this gives a point of damage. Oh, it won't kill a leader, but it could maybe kill some enemies yeah. for us. You ready? Ready. Start it. Okay, so what I'm thinking of doing is I'm coming over here and I'm going to go up with red and I'm just going to block it off. But that's what I'm thinking of doing with red. You're going to add dead end? Yeah, I'm going to dead end it and I'm going to take a wound. But that way I can get a bunch of resources and blow it out. Is that all right? Sounds good, yeah. Okay. I'm going to start building it. I know we only have one so far, but I'm just going to start building this research lab. Oh, nice. Okay. Gosh, why did we... We should switch sides, <laughs> I almost feel like, don't you? Oh, yeah, well, we'll probably move now, so... Okay, and this... Perfect, because then I can get three more weapons. Yep. Okay, I'm actually do. done. I'm done too. That's all I can oh, do. Because I have five seconds. So. Okay, perfect. Why don't we just stop it? Okay, 
So now we've finished the real time phase. Now we do creature movement. Okay, so he's gonna move. So he can see me. Yeah. So he's gonna move two. One, two. Now he would take a point of damage, but it's only one point. And he's a leader. Not, and they do not take partial damage. They don't. Yeah, they they have to be totally killed. So. He could go this way or this way. It doesn't really matter. They'd move one. They'd move one. Um, let's see. Let's do these ones well, first. Well, they can smell me. Oh, no. No, no there's no... See, one, so two, three, one, two, three, four. They actually don't smell you. They. I think they'd go my way. I think so, too. Yeah. One, two, three, four. And so would he. One, two... Well, let's see. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So this one could go either way. I think... Let's make him go this way because he might go through your trap. Yeah. That's a great idea. Then boom, boom, boom. Yep. Everybody moved. Okay. Now we spawn. So I did, I searched three. I only did three. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab like so for my three. Which three are you grabbing? Uh, yeah, sure. Doesn't matter too much to me. Okay. And just so you know, guys, I'm placing the dog here, which means he dies. Oh, I'm going to do two dogs. So two dogs and a zombie. So I'm going to place a dog here, the zombie here, and then the third one, dog here. Both of these two dogs die. Nice. So. I am not that lucky. No, we don't have a fog. Um, it's almost next to me anyway, so I might as well place the dog there. Not there. And we'll sure we'll put this guy here too. Okay. So we've placed new creatures. Now, wounds. I have to take a wound. So, we're going to grab from this wound pile, or deck. <gasps> yes, I didn't take a wound. And unfortunately, we know the next one we don't take a wound. <laughs> I'll shuffle this up. It's not cheating. Sorry, guys. Okay, there we go. It's hard. The deck moves. Okay. But I've taken one wound, so I have seven health. Still think it's worth it, because I am now going to blow that wall out. So, count your resources. This is Six. Oh, and I get three bullets, you guys, because I did a I did an action within this room. I placed an extra action token, so I get three bullets from supply. Nice. So I have thirteen bullets now. Are you done? Yep. Yeah, what bought, did you get? I bought two bombs. Oh, nice bomb, bombs. A heart that made twenty and a shield made twenty-five. Nice. And I bought um, stamina, uh, uh, adrenaline, and a, what are these called? A breach? Yeah. A breach, and then two bullets. Yeah. So, all right. Next, we're going to... Let's recover. See, recover. So let's grab all of our action so I get three, tokens. I get six now. Do you get six? I get six, too, because I have three and you have three. Yep, so we each get six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I'm going to break out my seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, in case I use my adrenaline. Or um, what is this, what is this adrenaline? called? Adrenaline. Yeah, adrenaline. And we replace knowledge. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I still don't have any labs. I get How many do you three. Oh, you get another lab. That's Sweet. perfect. It's actually really, really perfect. Okay, last time we did this wrong, we thought about what we were going to do, drew the event, and then we had to rethink. So this time we're going to draw the event. We're at round three. Let's start round three. Yeah. Confusion. All heroes randomly choose one face-up rune card from their display. Discard all cards in players' rooms display that are identical in shape and color. So essentially we have well, to discard one but plus. That, but that means that we don't get to replace it this round, right? Right. So we're short one. When I'm looking at these, and none of mine are the same color. So, you and just, so I'll just lose one. You might as well lose one of your plus ones. Well, no, it's random. Uh, Doesn't it say random? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so, man. Yeah. Okay, eyes are closed, eyes are closed. Let's oh, pick. I just oh, okay. Well, don't, no, you can't pick because you can see. I was just going to find oh, My eyes are closed. <laughs> I'm picking this one. Oh, not a bad one to lose. Okay, close your eyes. Okay, I'm going to close my eyes again. Where are they? This one. So if they're identical, we have to discard Yeah, so them, if you right? have a yellow four door. I don't think I do. If I have a red closed door. No, that was, I only had two yeah. yellows. Okay, I don't have so. a red closed door. Nice. Okay, and there was no trap on that one, right? Yep, no trap. So now let's think. Let's start that real time phase. You ready? Ready as I'm gonna be. All right. Okay, so can Wait, we- Wait, hold on, hold on. 
Go, okay. Can you blow the wall here so that we build onto the red? So Perfect. My... Oh, you're building on the red? I was going to build on the green. I was going to go green here and another green because that's going to put more green. Oh, you don't have any red. Green. I don't have any red. Can I build there and then you can still blow the wall? Okay, yep, yep. So I'm placing this, blowing the wall. Here you go. Okay, and then I'm just going to move into there. Ooh, you can't do it that way. No, ooh, you've got to have ooh. a... You've got to have a... I have a four-door. Oh, you have a four-door? Awesome. We can't place a four-door this round, right? No, that was no, last round. that was last round? Okay, cool. Then I'm going to go... Oh, that's not connecting my green anymore. So I'm gonna go here. Sorry. No, that's it's okay. Bad. And then I'm gonna go here, and then I'm gonna go shoot, cause that's all I can do. That's done. The timer's done. Timer's done. Timer's done. Oh. Yeah. So that's all you can. That's do. what you meant by yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. I was gonna search, but I ran out so of time. So was I. Yeah. Done. I probably didn't need it in red. Sorry, I spoiled your plans. Oh no, it's okay. Bummer. He's gonna get in your room. Because you didn't lay your bombs. Eh. Okay. Okay, I'll fight him next time. That's okay. okay. Um, sorry that I hit your arm <laughs> like that. <laughs> it's hard because uh, so you Didn't guys. Did you explore these two? Yeah, I explored both of those. They just weren't in the right spot because once again the arms were all over. We really should be on different sides. <laughs> um, the uh, timer. We're just we just looked on YouTube. There's no timer, and we when we were using the regular timer. Um, this one at least has beeping when you get close down to 10, but we still don't really hear it. We didn't find a good timer, which is a bummer. I wanted one that would said 10, 9, 8. Anyways, you know what I could have done? Oh. I just you thought of a... Create yourself a video. Well, no, like a countdown. Oh, that's a good idea. But I was thinking of a countdown for like uh, New Year's Eve. Yeah. You know? There's got to be a New Year's Eve countdown. Yeah, but it's probably like two minutes. Yeah, but you would just find where to start it for 45 yeah, seconds. I suppose. You know? <laughs> Maybe we should try that. We'll, we'll, we'll see. Okay. Sorry, guys. All right. So now we do enemy movement. So he's going to move two. Okay. They're going to move one. He's going to move one. Uh, one, two, three, four. So no seeing you, but they can still, they can still hear, hear you. you. No smelling, but they can hear you. Now, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. This guy is on his side. He doesn't hear anything. One, two, three. They can hear. Oh wait, first I gotta move these guys. One, two. Because there's a leader, so they move two. Same with this one. One, these three blooders die. Nice. But this zombie hangs out with this leader because they do two they have two health. Move there. Dead. They move just one. Well let's see. One, two, three. Yep, they still hear me. So they'll move here, but they'll die next time. Did I remove mm -hmm. these? Okay, so we've already done our movement. Next, we have to do our spawning. So I have to spawn. I only searched two, or only revealed two rooms. Did you do this this time? No, I don't know why I dropped two. There should only be one in here from blowing this up. Okay, but you still have action cubes in one, two, three, four rooms. Oh, are you serious? That's right. I'm going to take this cube back. I don't know why. You know, probably just dropped it. So, um... So four, I gotta do another leader, right? And I have three. So this leader, you guys, this leader can attack you from a distance. You will take a wound if you are within um, his line of sight. So that's terrible. And then I do three more, right? Yeah. So let's... Yeah. Um, one, two, three. Perfect. Whew. Okay. How many resources do you get this round? You didn't get any wounds, did you? I didn't get any wounds. Yeah, sorry. So now we move in to turn end phase. No wounds. Gain resources. I get... I did one, two, three times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So I get 30. Jeez. I get two, right? Four. Four. Two times two? Two by two. Four. And that's all she wrote for me. So I you could, could flip. You could take an advantage. Yeah, I might, might do that. might not be that. a bad idea. Uh, I'm on Turn yellow. the plus one over. Yeah. It's a plus four. Um, so that's what, six? So that gets me ten resources. Yeah. Ten resources I could at least buy an, another stamina. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to buy a stamina. And a bullet. That's all I'm getting. We still have not done a battle. 
Um, correct. But I'm going to have to. Yeah. So should I explain well, to them? Why don't you first, first buy, buy my and then, yeah. So I might as well get my last one of these. That's eight, which means I have 22 left. Get some luck. Don't we want some luck now? I thinking about it. Luck would be really nice. Luck. So luck is really cool because you can use it, and Monica could say, I'm going to use my luck here. None of these enemies would move, or they'd move minus one. You or know, you can use your luck in the slow phase. Just Yeah, in the slow phase. But that's when they're moving. Yeah. She could put them here, and then this leader would only move one. And so then all of the people with the leader would only move one. So that's what luck does. What we really need is another lab so we can get our first clue. I know. I'm hoping that we're going to draw it, and then I can... I'm not supposed to be strategizing. Yes, you're not strategizing. I'm not strategizing at all. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> that is the hardest part about this game, you guys. The hardest part. Or you can get an, another adrenaline and then not worry oh, about it. But yeah, the but then you don't have to worry is, about it. Well, I'm, so I could get one just in case. Yeah. So that's, and then get a bunch of bombs. You so could, Because you can drop three bombs with one action point in yeah. here and it would blow all those guys up. That's a bomb and a clover. We'll do that. Bomb and a clover? Yep. Nice. Okay. All right, now we clean up. Let's grab these off. <laughs> so awkward. <laughs> okay, and then, oh, darn it. I put mine over here. I think I had three left. Yes, I had three left. So then you refresh up, and I have three, four, five. I get seven, and I think you do too, right? Yep. One, two, three, four. Awesome. So I actually don't really need my syringes as much this time. Yeah, I only have six action cubes left, so it'd be silly to use the syringe. Four. Yeah. Okay, now we go into round four, so let's draw our event. Here we have doubts. Lab cards do not reveal clue cards, and a trap. Bummer. That's really bad for me because I only have one open way. Ooh. Yeah, I might be taking another wound. So here's yours, and here's mine. Oh my gosh, and it blocks me off. And I'm going to block this way off if that's all right. We have to explore to go this way. That's insane. I have to take out a zombie and one of these guys, so I have to do nine hits. <laughs> Something we forgot, you guys, and that might have changed those two, actually, but should we switch that? Hmm. Because we should have drawn up first. So, yeah, yeah, you know what? These two would have been given to us. So, one, two, three, four, well, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And what do you need? I need four. And no labs. Well, my good timing. Good timing for no labs. But now we do the traps. So, mine would be this one. Oh, times three enemy movement. Ugh. Oh, and yours would be times two enemy movement. Oh, I think the times are not... Oh, that's not enemy movement. That's we spawn three more enemies. These symbols require the player to place two or three creatures in the room immediately after it is placed. So we have to place three creatures in this room? Yeah, and I have to place two in this one. So what happens? Oh, if we run out, we just run out. That's the whole rule. Okay, so... One, put them two. All in. Oh, you can't put them all in my. And now that he's here, what happens? Well, nothing for this round because the enemy is oh, already. So it's during their movement phase. We'll lose one action cube. Yeah. So his ability is you lose. Everybody loses one action cube while he's on the on the board. Okay. So now we've got tons of enemies, and Monica has to do a fighting. Uh, uh, so we're going to show you how to do that. How this is going to work is she's going to grab a certain amount and she gets to choose however amount of bullets she wants to use and how many action cubes she wants to use. So why don't you show them quick. So I am only fighting one dog right now. I need three successes. I'm trying to decide. I think I'm going to take two action cubes and f four bullets. Okay. And then I roll them onto these square grid. Okay, so if they're touching a square, they're a success. So this one's a success, this one's a success, and I did a really good job here. This one's a success, <laughs> and that one's a success. 
Can I count that for the... Um, no, you can't. Man. So the way that you score it is you get you multiply the colored cubes by the gray cubes. So I got two orange cubes successes and two gray cubes successes. So two times two is four. I needed three to take him out, so I would have taken him out. The other points to note um, when doing combat is if you totally miss, it doesn't count. Or if you have two cubes that are overlapping the same square, neither one of them counts. Which uh, that's just unfair. Really no. stinks. <laughs> However, you can use an advantage, so flipping over one of your cards, so that to take a non-success. Tiles, one of your tiles. You flip it over. Room cards, yeah. To make a non-success into a success. So if you miss by one, then you probably likely would want to take an advantage to make it a success. So that's all happening, by the way, in real time. So yes, you're doing multiplication, multiplication and adding together in real time to ensure you defeat the enemy. You also can just dodge. To mm -hmm. dodge, you just need one simple success. Or, if depending on which enemy it is, you need two successes. Yeah, the tricker, and it says right here, tricker has one plus one dodge, so you need two successes instead of one to dodge him. You ready, Mon? I'm ready. Let's do it! Okay, I'm gonna go in there. I'm gonna kill that dog. I'm going to try and dodge. Three. I can dodge with bullets, right? I gotta take one advantage. One, two, three. I take I have him three, out. three, six, two times one is two. So I have two successes. I can uh, dodge. Oh, I have this one. So that's even more successes. I can go over here. I'm definitely gonna search in red. And I'm gonna move to here. No, I'm. I think I'm gonna I, just stop there. I'm done. These all are used. Shoot! I was gonna place my bombs. I should just uh, place the bombs where we are. Yes, place them where you are. You got two seconds. Awesome! You always forget Man. to place your bombs. That's okay. That's okay. Ugh, but I actually, know, but it would have been so much better in the room because I don't even know if they're going to be useful there. Yeah, they are because we're going to have things going in there. Because we're going to keep. Yeah, don't worry about it. Okay. They'll be useful. Okay. Okay, so first thing, enemy movement. So they move two. Yeah, so one, bummer, two. They're both in here. Why is there, where's my third, here we go, because I searched. There we go. They're going to move one, they're going to move two, and because he moved, we each lose an action cube. He gets three. Thank you, he gets three. And we each lose an action cube. Oh, that's terrible. How many are in here? So there is a, a rule. You can have no more than seven enemies together or six when you have a leader. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one of these has to stay back. These guys would want to go here, but then they can't they can't go into that room. And the sniffer doesn't push. The trampler, where's the trampler? Right he could push himself into that room. But they all move to here. They'll move to here. One, two, three. He can still hear. One, two. Oh, this is a leader. This would move here, and he's going to wound both of us. Ouch. Yep. I have a shit. He can move. <clears throat> These guys fall in the trap. Which is almost unfortunate. I Actually, them. no, they don't. One, two, three. They don't hear oh, you're it or right. anything. That's awesome. Now, this guy's been asleep since so last round, so off. he comes off. And they're going to be asleep for this round. They, did you move them? No. Nope. So they'll move to here. And if we, if I didn't move them, sorry, guys. <laughs> I don't think I did. Okay, now we spawn. So how does this work? So I... I have three cubes, right? One, two, three in each room. So I got to spawn three. We only have one. So put that here. Yeah. Okay. After that, then we go to... So we've already placed new creatures. Now we do wounds. We each take one wound. So this is for me. <gasps> Regular. Me. Oh. You didn't have to draw a wound. Oh, yeah. I don't have to draw one. Sorry, you got to shuffle. Oh, I shuffle. Just give up I one of your shields. shields. Oh, I'm so glad we thought of that. <laughs> All right, but I have two. I'm hurt. I can put up this hospital. Okay. I've got a hospital too, but it's the wrong color. Now we gain resources. So we each searched. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven times. Um, I'm eleven times two because I didn't actually. Uh, Explore. Explore. So I'm at 
Oh, 22 plus 1 is 23, right? No, because you didn't explore that Oh, I didn't explore. So I'm just at 22. And I'm at 30. I'm maxed. You're always maxed. You always have so many. Okay, we just drop a ton of bombs here, don't you think? But here's the thing. That's such a waste of your time. We need to keep, you know... um, Oh, oh, well, okay, we're, we're we strategizing, we're strategizing, we shouldn't be strategizing. Well, technically we're supposed to gain our resources first. Oh, that's right, so we're trying to determine what to buy. See, this is so hard, because how would you not strategize when you're buying your items? Right, I that's just, why we always start I don't about. get it, I don't get how you're not supposed to do that. Okay, just think about the items that you want. So I got uh, a shield, some luck, and another knowledge. Oh, and you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to discard this one and this one for three more resources, and this one and this one, this one for three more. So I've got six more resources. So this was seven, 14, plus five is 19, 21, plus I got six more resources, and I had 22, so 28. So I've got seven more resources. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to return the book. That was seven, and buy two more bombs. I think I mean, we're just gonna drop a ton here. I think so too. I think there's a max of six that we can put in, in that room. room. Yeah. yeah. So how many did you buy? Because I bought two, so you can only put one in there. If. Um, I'm probably gonna put them in the next room. Okay, perfect. Just give us a little bit of a total break. I have eight left. What have you been buying? Can you put them out here so they know? I was thinking about buying this breach, but I don't know that I have room. Just in case we need it? Yeah, because we don't know what's going to happen. It'd be nice to have a breach. Well, I could do this. Yeah. Oops, I did that wrong. I could do this. That's 15, 21. This makes 30. Why don't you do that? Let's do that for this room. Okay. Okay. I got one whopping bullet, but... Okay. Now, knowledge. Oh, you got a lab. I, I got two labs. Red. Oh, if only that was red. So if I you know. can do a lab, you guys, and the lab is having three of these uh, adjacent to each other. Oh, and it even works. It even fits in there. That's awesome. Um, because that one doesn't. But if they can all be the same color, you get to draw two clues. So we'll be able to draw one clue as long as I'm able to drop that. All right, but here. Oh, you get one too, right? Is that the right one? It's the same thing, isn't it? No, I'd have to blow. I'd this have to is... blow a wall where I am. No, and you'd you'd have a problem here. And I'd have a problem there. It's the same problem. Man, oh man. Yeah, I know. It's so annoying. Okay, draw. Uh, Don't talk. Yep. Yeah. Draw an event card. So we're at round what? One, two, three. This is round five. This is round five. Infection crisis. All heroes must flip one face-up card of their room's display without receiving an advantage. So basically, we have to lose Oops. one of our rooms. I'm going to do... Oh, man, that sucks. I'm going to do this room. Do Actually, this no, I'm going to do yellow. Okay, let's think on our own, and then, make it, and then we'll start it up. Let's take our cubes off. And I think we've each done our internal thinking. <laughs> I've used all my cubes this time, I guess. I didn't even realize that. I and then we will refresh. I think we each get seven, right? Yep. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I've got my seven ready for me. I think we're ready. This is going to hurt. Monica, are you okay taking out the enemies so I can run over here, blow this wall, and do this? Yeah. Can you give me the, the breach thing then? Yes. Awesome, so we can awesome, share awesome. share resources when they're in the same room. Okay, so I'm going to just leave and I'm, I'm going to say you rock. Now, I have since to discard I'm... one positive because yeah. Colin's leaving the room. Thank you for that. I'm um, going to go here, and then I'm going to go so here, three. and I'm going to use my adrenaline to get seven more. I'm going to take three of these and four of these. And I'm going so to fight. Three, two, six. And let's see. One, two, out. three, four, 
four, so two, one, two, three. Three times one is three. I don't have enough. I'm gonna have to take an advantage. That will give me this. So that's times two up. times two is four, six. So okay, you I can just killed. Always finish them. combat. Yep, I just killed both of those two. Uh, I didn't get the thing. I was out. gonna explore in this room, and I totally forgot. Yeah, and you know what I didn't do? I didn't um, drop bombs. my bombs. Not that it matters, anyways, because I didn't leave this room. Golly, it took that long. Because I guess we just, how in the world are we supposed to do this? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, all of these go back to the supply. Oh, look at all of these that I got from that adrenaline. I lost all of them. You used your adrenaline? Yeah, I had to because I didn't have enough because oh, I have ran man. all the way around over here. All right, uh, enemy movement. So, one, two, three, four. You're going to take a wound from this guy. I have a shield. Awesome. Okay. They're going to move here, and then the bombs take out so these need... three. Oh, yeah. It has to kill the yep. lowest creatures first. Yep. So those three. That's nice. And then they move here. This dog moves two. They move two. They move two. Let's see. Is that too many? I think so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So two go. Seven, six. Can you have two leaders? As far as I know. Okay. Uh, one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So they're actually going to move here. This guy's going to come into my room. Okay. Oh, that's a bummer because now I have to dodge him. Yeah, I have to dodge him again and I just don't have a lot of actions. But I should be able to... Oh, man. I gotta have enough. Okay. So, after a creature movement, then we place new creatures. So, I have one, two, three. Golly. I spawn another leader. But there aren't any oh, leaders. Two. Oh, and by the way, did you have an action cube left? Yes. You lose one. Because... He moved. The, yep. Uh, which guy is it? This guy moved. The guy with the, the axe. axe. <laughs> so, then, uh, after that, then we spawn. So... I'm going to spawn, I spawn four, and there's no leaders, so I'm just going to spawn regular four. I have One, two. They're both going to go. Three. Here. Four. Okay. Then, wounds. So you take one wound, I but you did that. You just So we gain resources. So I didn't do any exploring. I get a whopping two. I didn't do any exploring, but I can discard similar... Oh, yeah. I have two of these I wanted to discard. So I get five. You get five? I could take an advantage for three? Six. An advantage is six. Whew, I'm eating up my... I know. But I really want another adrenaline in case I need it. Oh, I should have passed you one. What? You, what heck have you knew? Or should I take a chance? I do get seven more action cubes. Yeah. Uh, I'm not going to get anything. I'm just going to hope I can do it. I've got two bombs. Oh, I had luck. Can I pretend that I use my luck this on this guy? Yeah, yeah, and then you don't have to dodge him. Awesome. Sorry, you guys. Just forgot about my luck. Oh, it's good to be Irish. Okay. <laughs> then I have a shield. Oh, that's awesome. Then I definitely don't need adrenaline. I should be good. Are you good? Wait, wait. You haven't bought anything. I have five. You have five? What can you buy with five? You need bullets. Or I could buy one shield and then I'm in a bullet room. That'll oh, give yeah. me Oh, yeah. Three, You're six, in one nine. shield. You have a ton of shields. Nice. Yeah, but I think I'm going to be drawing attacks. Will you go run off to La La Land? Run off over here? Yeah. Okay. All right. So after that, we uh, refresh knowledge. Yep, I'm going to take my cubes off. How many do you get? One, two... Three. Three. Four labs would you be got, nice. Well, two. you got... You have two labs, by mm -hmm. the way. And then... And you have one. The problem is it's hooking them up. Yep. Yeah, especially because there's traps over here. Now, these traps don't spawn every time. It's no, just no, no, once. No. Okay. Not per my understanding of the rules. Oh, I take a wound because I use my um, adrenaline. Yes, you do. And it's a deep wound. And you take a wound because you have a deep wound. I didn't get a deep wound. Oh, Remember, that's right. I prevented it with my okay. shield. So I now have a deep wound. That stinks. So that's three damage. Well, we don't have... How many rounds do we have left? 
We've played five. So we've got four more rounds. Mm -hmm. I can take four more points of damage. <laughs> Who cares about the deep wound? I'm bleeding. My little pond guy's hurt, but we're still going to push through. Okay. After filling up, we've taken these, and then let's refresh our action tokens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wow, I don't have a lot of bullets either, actually, to be honest. Uh, after that, then we draw an event for round six. This one says that the lead player has to choose a, a character, and that character has to take a face-down wound. Here's the thing. We haven't been keeping track of who's the leader, but Monica and I both have decided that Monica's going to take that one since I have a deep wound. So, thanks, hun. So you just grab a wound and... no, oh, yours oh, is deep. Man. That stinks. Two deep wounds. It stinks when you get wounded from a... Wait, what was that? A contagion? Contagion. contagion. Okay. Well, let's think about what we want to do, and then we'll be right back. You ready? I'm ready. <laughs> let's do it. Maybe. Oh, come on. There we go. Okay, I'm going to break this up. I'm going to put this out so I'm we get a clue. Just fight. You're just going to fight? Okay, I'm just going to do it. So I'm going to do this. Let's put this out. Then I'm going to do this. I'm fighting adjacently, which means I lose here. two positives. And I'm going to drop three for this. And then I'm going to move into here. I'm going to drop two bombs. No, I'm just going to... 10 seconds, hon. 10 seconds. Uh, I'm going to take one advantage. Yeah, I'm going to move here. I Done. Can always, I can finish combat. Oh, you though. can finish combat? Yeah. Okay. I decided so not to waste I my have bonus. one, two, three times. One, two, three, four. Four times three is 12. 12, yeah. So three, six... Hold on, hold on. you got to lose two successes... Or three, how many successes do you have to lose? So three, six, nine. Do you want to, instead of doing one of those guys, do the two guys to so get rid of the two pointer? One of the two. It doesn't matter. It equates to being the same. That's a good point. But it leaves another enemy on the board. Yep, so there's less spawning. That's actually three, six, nine. Should I do this guy? Can you do can you choose? I think so. Oh yeah. Well, Take the leader out because once I'm not going to spawn a leader. Okay. And you're not spawning anything. I am. Exp I have to spawn one. Oh, because you have cubes here, mm -hmm. so you have to spawn one. Bummer. Okay. Wow. All right. So first enemy movement. So they're all going to move into your room. Yep. So are they? They're all going to move into your room, and you take uh, uh you lose a shield because he attacks you from range. Let's see, so. Wow. One, two, three, four, five, six. And they go here. They're gonna. They can't see me. Yeah, I couldn't. Have... They can see you. How did this get placed here? We cheated somewhere. No. Oh, look, guys, we cheated. Well, it is what it is. That wasn't me, because I placed this one. So that must have been from before. <laughs> oh well, we're just gonna pretend there's a door. Because I I pretended like I went through that. Mm -hmm. I thought that was a door. So we're just gonna pretend that's a door. Sorry, you guys. That's the thing with real time. I just can't believe you have to real time match doors and do all of this and try and. Ugh, anyways, okay. Um, we didn't move this guy yet, did we? Mm -mm. No. One. So he'd because he, he doesn't see you, so he'd hear this way. They are going to come into my room. I think we... Do you want to... Oh, yes. If you're okay using your yep. luck, then they would go here. I haven't moved them. So they would go here. There's a dog. There's a dog. Okay. You didn't move them. Yeah, I did. Oh, you did? Yes. Okay. So, now we spawn. So, I do three and you do one. And what we're going to do, just so that we remember that this is a door. Just put a breach just put, on it. We should, can you grab another breach from the supply? Because we should have one more. But, or we can just say we lost one since we did it wrong. I know, but that would, that's our last one. 
No, it's not. We've got one more, don't we? Mm-hmm. Okay, so we'll just say that we had to use it. <gasps> I'm sorry, you guys. Okay, so so and you did you would you spawn your one? Yeah, I did. Okay, so then the next thing is um, resources. So you know how many resources you get? None. You, you but you put three cubes in here. Yeah, oh, but I didn't explore. That's not for exploring. That's for your bullets. Okay, and I got three. Um, no, two, three. I got thirty resources. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve times two, three. Um, twelve, twelve, four, thirty-six. So I got thirty, which is amazing. And that's it. Okay. And refresh. So I get seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And our next event, round six. System reboot. Exit rooms may not be activated. If the exit door has already been opened, the exit is closed and must be reopened. All door tiles are reset to the open side, which is hilarious because there is no open side, you guys. We even looked. It looks identical. I, uh, yeah, okay. So what this means is if we had been there, we'd have to go back and re-unlock these, but we haven't, we haven't done that yet. Um, and we're supposed to lay a trap. So there was that trap icon, but... Uh, I can't place a trap and neither can Monica. So actually it has no effect on us. We also get to refresh our knowledge. How many do you get? No. Okay. And then the other thing is we get our clue. So let's look at our clue because we did sort of cheat, <laughs> but at least we do still have our lab here. So let's grab our single clue. Here's our first clue. So we can see that here's the starting tile and the room that contains the serum is in rows one two three four on the right side of the entrance so right now it's in one of these four square tiles okay rooms. but if we explore more rooms over here those ones also become potentials so we um we know that we're we're paring it down so we'll put this over here for our first clue you ready mon i'm ready okay let's get going Okay, Monica, you're just fighting? Yeah, and I'm resting for 30 seconds to recover some okay. of my... So what I'm going to do is plot this down to drop all three bombs. So I can take out those two minions at least. Out of time, huh? Oh, my. And then I'm going to go over here. And then I'm going to uh, gonna search. search. So that's these. And then I'm going to do one to blow this up. And place this. And I can start. I'm doing here. combat. Perfect. Okay, I'm taking that advantage. And I think that was 15 seconds I wasn't doing anything. You're stopping. Oh, you mean you're, I you can, can finish. finish Gosh, I wish I would have known. I'm going to play it safe and say I didn't have 15 seconds left to flip one of these. So I, flip, I get to flip two of them back over. Um, so I might as well just leave one of them flipped. Oh, because you used one? Yeah, to get my heart on there. Oh, t tell them what the heart does. So you can re you can roll your tokens as well, and they say in red under... Is that what it's actually say? in white. It's the small ones. Oh, yeah. They say in white on the board what they do if you roll them in combat. I rolled a heart, which means I get po times two positive actions. So each action cube I roll is worth two. So I have one, two, three, four. That's eight times two is 16 successes <laughs> so that's three six nine oh sorry three six nine twelve fifteen unless i decide i want to dodge well do 15 and then 16 17 18. oh but you can't don't, don't can you can you can't take a rid of one of these guys instead of the dog yeah because they're two dodge yep okay so that's 3, 6, 9, 12. I only had 16 successes. Yeah. 3, 6, 9, 12, 13, 14, 15. I can only dodge one. You can only dodge one, then you take so two So I dodge this guy. Because he hits for two, right? And or no. I have two shields. Oh, and you have two shields? Awesome. Problem is, is... You're just going to keep... You're going to keep getting loaded up, hon. 
I'm not spawning anything new this round. Yeah, that's nice. I'm spawning three new enemies. Um, okay, but you finished your movement? Yep. So because then all these guys come in here again. I know. But at least there's not going to be any new ones. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And they'll move. They have a plus one, so they're going to move two. Or wait, one, two, three, four. No, they're going to move two towards me. But I'm going to actually, because we can decide how they go, right? I'm going to have these mm -hmm. guys go first. Those three bombs are going to take out these two guys. And then he goes here. And these bombs are gone. This dog is going to connect up. And they move two. One, two, three. So he's going to move one this way. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Perfect. Oh my gosh. You really cleared off the board. Well, yeah. I mean, look at this. Then I just have to spawn three. One, two, three. So I'm going to do one, two. And I can put all three in here since both of these have enemies, mm -hmm. right? Perfect. Well, might as well put the dog in here. Nah. Yeah, I'll put it there. Okay. Then after that, let's uh, let's count up our um, wounds. So we each have a deep wound. So we each take one mm -hmm. wound. And it doesn't matter if it's a deep wound. We already yeah, have a deep, deep wound. wound. I, th I think, right? You can't take two That's deep my wounds. Understanding. Okay, so I now have four wounds. I'm at half health. I have two. And then <clears throat> from there, we'll gain resources. So three. I get zero. Four. Oh, wait. Wait, two, three. And then three times one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen, twenty-six, thirty-nine. Yeah, I get thirty. I can't believe it maxes out in thirty. That's so stupid. Take these. And I now have no more um whatchamacallums? Breaches. We have no more of these breaches at all. Right. We can't pre create a door or something? <laughs> no. Okay, so let's refill. You didn't get rid of any. I don't have any labs. This is this is a problem. It's actually a real big, real big problem. We're almost out of rounds. Yeah, too. that's what I'm saying. Is we're 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 really running low here. That was round seven. Sorry, you guys. So we miscalculated on our rounds, and we thought that this was going to be the last round, and so we were just going to call it because there was no way. But turns out we have two more rounds left. Oh, my goodness. So much time to be able to go all the way to these exit tiles, also find another clue, and get back to the exit. We can totally do that, right? And we don't have a and lab. Labs. Yeah. You do, but you're way over there. And <laughs> stuck with... How many enemies do I have on me Seven. No, one, seven, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Before I can do anything else. Yeah. Well, what's your problem over there, you know? <laughs> at least you can use three action items to just keep getting bullets. You know, at least it happens. don't get any resources. Yeah, it happens in the ammunition room, you know? Um, okay. Well. Uh, yeah, I'm just picking guns <laughs> off the wall. <laughs> Here's another one. <laughs> you know, okay. Anyways. All right. Well, you know what you're going to do? Because I know what I'm doing. Yeah. Okay. Start her up. Thinking. Wait, wait, wait. D wait, I thought you just said you know what you're doing. I oh, know you know what? About what I'm doing. I forgot that um, we should... Uh, I don't have my seven action height tokens. Oh, yeah, I get one, to refresh. Two, three, I was thinking three. Four, five, six, six <laughs> seven. <laughs> I spent oh. one of my hearts, so I only get six. Oh, I have two Granted, shields. Granted, to sit in a room and fight, I don't need a whole lot of action. No, you don't. <laughs> well, I do as a roll. Okay, think about what you want to do. Let me know when you're ready, and we'll start the timer. Ready, guys? Let's go. Okay, you're fighting. I'm going to just start moving. One. Two. That's terrible. Two. And... Let's pretend that when I was in here, I would have been smart and dropped three action cubes so I could search. I'm going to go here. Now I'm going to wait 15 seconds to flip one of these up. Okay. Seven, six. It doesn't five, matter. Four. Cool. Oh, okay. That's no, that's for me. Okay. 
I can get a whole whopping two more. One, two, three times two is six. Six times one, two, three, four is 24. Yeah. Three. No, 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 no. Those are, those are six each. Because those are zombies. Six. Twelve. Actually, that kills me. So let's take the other guys. Because they only do one damage, right? Yep. They still only do. These guys yeah. do two damage. Yes, so that's what you three, need to know. Six. Nine, twelve. That would be 15, 18. 18. I get twenty-four. You can so take out one more. more. And then you just take one one point of damage, and so you got a shield, yeah, right? One more shield. <laughs> You're insane over there. I'm down to only one more heart. I, well, two extra. Hearts. Two extra hearts. I got to the exit tile. <laughs> Do you draw any more? Oh, you don't know if you drew any more. No, I don't know yet. Okay, so now enemy movement. One, two, and they all come and join you with that zombie. Hey, I might actually be able to take the rest of them out. Oh this my time. gosh, that would be amazing. There's a dog in this group, so they all move too, because the dog brings them with. One, two, three, four. Somehow this blutter is hearing me or smelling. No, hearing me. So he moves here. Then we spawn. You don't spawn any. I just spawn three. So I spawn one because oh, I picked up some bullets. Oh, okay. One, two. Three. And then we, after doing that, we each gain a wound because we have deep wounds. Oh, man. Yeah. You did, One, yet. two, three, four, five. No, I got four health left. I may be bleeding you out, but I'm not left. I'm not fighting all these people like you are. Good thing I picked up. I have all these adrenaline tokens that yes, I thought right. I would need, and I and didn't at all they've kind of been useless okay so we've done the moving we've done the spawning now we gather resources you don't get any i get 30 because i did search the uh well i think so i get 30 so this gives me two right but i didn't so two times so as long as there's one 15. two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen so it's just 26, 26. only 26. 26 so i'm gonna get six twelve twelve eighteen uh 24. Just gonna get a bunch of bombs. And two bullets? Well, well, well one bullet. Up. 26. Yeah, one bullet. Right. Awesome. All right, let's just do the last round. We know we aren't gonna win because there's just no way it's gonna happen, but let's just do it for fun. Let's see if I can take out the rest of those. Yeah, guys. if you could take out those guys, that'd be sweet. <laughs> okay, let's draw our event. Well, draw back up your. Oh, yeah. Oh, I get a lab. And that's it. I only get one lab, so there's no way that I can do it. I was hoping I'd get two labs. And somehow, but I only get one. Hmm. When we were in the same room, I wonder if we could have passed rooms. We could have, but there was so point, much going on. Yeah. yeah, there was no way that was going to happen. I mean, we, we cheated with this room here. <laughs> not the end of the world. No, not the end of the world. Okay, so let's draw our event. Our final event, which really doesn't matter, is the Wasp Nest. All creatures are placed in rooms with at least a, one hero where possible. But we're not going to be spawning this round, so that's pretty much useless, which is great. And there is no trap, so we don't have to worry about traps. Let's refresh, and then we can get ready to rock. So apparently we cannot count rounds, you guys. This is, this is so weird because you're supposed to have a certain amount of cards in your discard pile, but then you have to add one to determine your round. Anyways, we think we have two more rounds. I... I have said before we've had our last round. It's not. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven plus one, because the first round doesn't have an, eight, uh, uh, an event, is eight. There's a total of nine rounds. So we are at the second to last round here. So let's get going. You ready, hon? Yep. All right. You've got all of your action cubes reset? Yep. Okay. Hold on. Let me get some out. I might use my adrenaline this time. Yeah, I've got my adrenaline ready. Yeah. I'm ready to just... Blow through. Let's go. Okay. Place that there. And then that's terrible. That's a trap. This one. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Yep, there we go. Do that one. I got one. Let's see up here. Here and there's three plus one is four. And I was stupid. Oh, I hate when I'm stupid. 
but I'm gonna go here. Awesome. That's it's done. But okay. So I was I stupid. Had enough I was so stupid. Oh. To take out most of them, and then I dodged the rest. Oh, nice. How many did you take out? Although I'm gonna have to fight them anyways next time. Should I just take the wounds? No, you dodged. It's I okay. Dodged. Yeah. I took out four, I think, three or oh, four. Oh, nice. So are these the ones that are left? Yeah. Okay. So I um, set up one of these so I could do this, but then I set this out. So it's now impossible to make a lap. <laughs> yep. uh, I love real-time stuff when it's like this. Oh, well. But look at I get to draw so many more. That's what I wanted to so do. maybe you can put one here and here. That's what I'm hoping. Of course, I'm in a room that's, you know, close. And then when you do, we still have to go back here, step on the doors, and then we have to get the exit. Well, and we don't even know if that clue is going to help us determine. Because now I've added a ton of more. Yeah. <laughs> but all right enemy movement first so mine's one, easy yeah y'all come one, join me again two. it's like they like me or something i don't know why one two actually i kind of know why i like you one two three four five six seven cool this guy one two three finally this guy goes to sleep then we spawn i went into one two three four five oh, I so i have five so i have to pull out one of these guys put him here one Two, three, four, no, four, five. But I'm here. I get to heal my deep wound. That's the whole reason I did that. No, I didn't put an action cube there. Mm -hmm. That's silly. Oh, well. So now, uh, after all that, uh, we've spawned, and it's time to take our wounds. So, I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I have two health left. Hey, it's last round. Yeah. All right, you guys, last round, we're totally not going to win this. But that's okay. We're still going to try. So, I'm going to refresh. Oh, and not only no that. Labs. No labs. No labs. No labs. There's a lab right here. But I forgot resources. I did three... So that's two, three, four, five, right? Because I... Two, three, four, five. Times three is 15. Five. Plus I did this one, so Plus 16 one. and 17. So I have 17. I have all of these bombs. At 17, I'm going to... Luck doesn't did matter. Did you have a luck by any chance? You didn't, did you? No. Okay. Sorry. No, not a problem. <laughs> At this point, it doesn't matter too yeah. much. Uh, 17. What, I'm going to grab 6, 12, 2 bombs, and uh, a fiber. That's 17 for another shield. Okay. Are you ready? No, I'm not ready. Let's get all of these out. Slowpoke. And then why don't you draw the event? Oh, yeah. Last one. We promise this time. Yeah. We have a wake. Stand up all laid down creatures and move them up to four rooms towards the nearest hero. If two or more heroes are equidistant, the leader chooses to move them. Creatures stop if they enter any room containing a hero. So we only got this dude sleeping. So he'll just go one, two, three, four. And then he's now one step away from Monica. Okay, now let's make some decisions on what we're going to do. It, by ourselves. Of course. Final round, we promise. Let's go. Go. All right, I'm going in here. I'm just going to take a wound because I'm just going to keep going and go here and then go here and then go here and then go here and then go here. And actually, instead of going that way, I'm going to go. No, I'm going to go that way. I'm going to go here. I'm going to take another wound, which I think would kill me. And I go here. And then I'm gonna go and dodge them all. here, I'm gonna go here. <laughs> and I'm gonna use this adrenaline to draw these. And I'm just gonna just keep going. I'm making so I'm much noise. Up a I'm running over here. I'm coming over here. Now I'm oh, over here. Sorry, I'm way over in your way. Oh, it's okay. How did you get way over here? I Put just a ran. Lab. Put a lab. I don't have any more oh, labs. We're done. Oh man, look at this. I ran all the way over. Seriously? <laughs> How did you do that? <laughs> I used an adrenaline. I'm pretty sure I died, though, because I would have taken... Oh, he would have hit me for two. I totally would have died. But that's okay. 
Oh no, because I heal. No, I didn't a activate this. I should have activated that. It's okay. But that's right. Just ran all the way over. That's impressive. <laughs> yeah, well, I dodged all those guys, I think. I think I did my math right. I used like four advantages. <laughs> Actually, all of the rest of my cards have been used. Oh, that's awesome. To dodge them and to put two of our three laps. If we would have gotten another clue, it would have been really unuseful. It would have told us what? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, these three. So it would have been in this cluster now. Wow, we would have to get a whole nother clue. What would have been the next one? It's in a room that has... One. That is next... A room with three doors... Next that is to next to a room with, with three, three doors. doors. And they're back to back. We don't have that. So would we either have to create so, that or this would get discarded? I think... I don't know the rule in that case. I I'm think it gets discarded. I'm pretty sure it gets discarded and you draw a new one. A room with four doors and no enemies. So then it would have been this room or this room. Yep. Wow. So we still wouldn't know. I mean, hypothetically, there might have been only one when we drew that card. Yeah. But yeah. But yeah. Wow. Okay. We had a hard enough time getting one lab. I know. Set up. This time we had a really hard time with labs. Yeah. <sighs> okay, you guys. Quick final thoughts. What we like about the game. Let's talk about that first. There's a really lot, a lot of really good ideas like there's some really cool things I, I think the way to roll for combat is interesting although to do it in real time is rather difficult um yeah if it wasn't real time it'd actually be kind of more fun with that you know yeah it would yeah, yeah. i like being able to flip cards to use as advantages because it takes a little bit of the luck out of it um i can i can be a little more sure that i'll at least get what i need you can mitigate it right I love this action cube thing where you basically leave a trail of breadcrumbs along the way. And Colin and left a lot of breadcrumbs. <laughs> and I still don't know how he did that. <laughs> well, I had three left over, added you seven. You could have uh, gone the short way. Well, I didn't know. I was just going to go here, but then I had another 20 seconds left. So I went, oh, I'm just going to follow you and find you. So, um, you know, that's what happens in real life, you know, <laughs> or real time. You, you don't always take the most um, straight path. Uh, so really like that idea I, I like how the board comes alive with the 3d tokens um these these uh, breaches we never have ever used a door or um the problem with the door and the barriers is a door is only worth two damage points so as soon as you get two monsters behind it it just knocks down anyways yeah, so it doesn't and, really slow them down. Cause and in the case same you, with the barriers. They're, they're, I mean, you, as you see, we get clusters so yep. quickly that, to me, it's not worth putting them up. Yep. The traps are a cool idea. I like that. Mm -hmm. The plus one for monsters is a cool idea. The idea of the labs is awesome. It's just... Yeah, and if you, if you think it's hard to get three in a group, if you play with four players, you have to get four... Or three or four players, you have to get... F all four of them have to be labs to get a group clue. Okay, so that's what we like. <laughs> a lot of things that we don't like. First of all, the components are terrible. They're just terrible. This is, this is um, if you've ever played Aeon's End, this is the same as those breaches, uh, the the breach uh, cards. So they're like uh, kind of a cardboardy, not even, no, not even cardboard, just paper. Basically paper. Um, it's like cardstock. Yeah, cardstock. That's the word I'm thinking of, cardstock. And so, I mean, I already have a couple of them that are bent up because, of course, you're doing stuff in real time. You're moving around. Um, so tiles would have been nice. Yes, tiles would have been nice. Something that's a little bit sturdier. The minis are really poor quality. I mean, you can't even tell that this is a zombie. You know, um, they're not very good at all. Monica likes this. I don't. The the characters that um, come with the game, they put on this like weird base, so you know what color you are. Oh, it looks bad, I think. This does not well, look cool. Well, at least cool. I can tell who's who. I know, yeah. Well, I preferred the, these ponds way agree. better. I way more preferred the ponds. Uh, the 45 seconds, not enough time at all. And uh, especially when you can't strategize. And that non-strategizing thing was so hard for Monica and I, we had to keep catching ourselves. And that's not fun to us. We want to strategize. And so... Trying to strategize in real time, but you just don't have enough time to strategize. It ends up just being, I run over here and you run over there. And, you know, we had one time where it was kind of cool, 
not mm-hmm. cool, but you, you know, you guys got to see. Since we didn't plan, I wanted to do green through here and and search and get a bunch of green rooms. But Monica, because she saw this red, wanted to do red. And so Monica's like, I'm going to do red. I'm like, okay. But I didn't realize that she was going to block me totally off from the green. And so then I went up here with the yellow and got stuck because of it. You know, so it's it's cool. That was cool. But most of the time, I mean, we were off in different spots anyways. So we were kind of doing our own little thing. It just... I don't know. It's not a game that Monica and I are going to keep. It's not one that we would ever want to pick out. It's it's not something that we've enjoyed. Another idea that I think is pretty neat is I, I like the idea of trying to explore to oh, find yeah. the exits, but without like a grid on the table, getting those doors to line up in the right column and the right rows so that while you're playing in real time, you can figure out where they are. Um, is, is frustrating because they don't stay in the right spot even if you plan it out way in advance. At the beginning of the game, lay it in the right spot. By the time you get to it, it's probably not in the right spot anymore. Yeah, it had been so much nicer if they had just a board with a grid and you'd be placing the tiles. And it'd be tiles instead, and they would just fit into the grooves. And so you could quickly put those tiles yeah. there, and they'd, they'd plop into place. Instead of these, where all of a sudden the rooms are like this, and I'm sure that's how why we totally missed that there's a wall here, you know? Um, yeah. Anyways, well, and the last thing I really, really, I actually really like these clues idea, but um, like we said before, it's so hard to get a clue. Um, and then depending on your situation, it might take four or five clues before you actually figure out where the antidote is. Um, and in, in nine rounds, it's just, it's just not enough. Time. Just, no, no, I mean, we only got one clue. And the last thing is, I, I really. I wish get, there was a timer. It really bugs me whenever I get a real-time game that doesn't come with a timer, okay? I want something that counts down so I know because you're paying attention to the game. and this one, you have to pay so much attention. And there was at and least one or two times we went over because we didn't know it stopped. We didn't even know it stopped. And, you know, I'm trying to find a 45-second timer and probably could have found something else. But at this point, just use this. I, I, I mean, it's such a miss. It'd be so easy you know, either a simple app or even just something to give you to track the 45 seconds. So, yeah, anyways. Okay, that's Virus. Hope you guys can make your decision on if you like it or not. Um, And thanks so much for watching, and thanks for uh, being a part of the channel. Appreciate it.